On what would have been Ahmed Kathwara's 93rd birthday, August 21, 2022, the Ahmed Kathwara Foundation celebrated his life with an exhibition launch at Constitution Hill. Amongst attendees were former Minister of Public Enterprises and spouse Barbara Hogan and South Commissioner Edward Kisveta. It is precisely because of who he is and represents that we need to make a fuss of him today to honor his life of selfless sacrifice. A life that started when he was still a boy, deprived of the life of a carefree child and teenager, to memorialize his immense contribution to our freedom and to thank him for the difference he has made. Kathy, being Kathy, decided that in solidarity with his comrades, he will not appeal and he would spend in, the, in those days, the rest of his life in jail. He was only 34 years old, if I remember correctly. So he was young, he was in the prime of his life, but he chose not to appeal. He sacrificed his life and went to jail. This exhibition was important to be done for all of the people who come here to draw lessons from history, to, to draw encouragement and inspiration. Uh, his life and his story tells us about his activism at the time and there are many lessons from that that we can draw today and that's primarily that any struggle requires sacrifice, requires effort, requires dedication and most importantly requires selfless commitment. In honor of the late struggle veteran Ahmed Kathwada, the Constitution Hill has officially opened an exhibition displaying his life and legacy. The exhibition is located at the Old Fort section and is open to the public. Kiam Khatumatlala for Vets News, Johannesburg.